Good afternoon, everyone. For those of you who don't know who I am, my name is Evan Geyer. At the end of this short movie, I will tell you about and talk about what I would want if I were on The Bachelor on The Bachelor. Something that hasn't occurred on any of The Bachelors that I've seen this far. So, um, moving on to the theory of fusion. Um, I had a dream where there was the Big Bang and it got cold. That was the dream. And then I kind of woke up after that. Um, I, I don't think that the creation of energy and the Big Bang happened at the same occurrence, at the same period of time. I think the Big Bang occurred and then energy became created as a result of movement from the Big Bang. So they say they don't know how the Big Bang was created. They just know that there is a Big Bang and that the universe is still expanding. Well, in my theory of fusion, the Big Bang occurred because of sex. And Adam split because it had sex. And then, boom, just an ever-expanding universe. Is it dangerous? How long will it last? That I don't exactly know. Um, atoms, for some reason, were getting pushed together and closer. And then there was sex because an atom split and caused a big bang. So there was something pushing together atoms. And then two atoms got close. They had sex. And then, boom, the Big Bang. And then the atoms that didn't have sex were moving and creating energy um, like stars. Except for the stars that we see out in space today aren't creating energy anymore. They've burnt out. So we, 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 there, were, there was the creation of energy and fusion and... Um, in space, and some of the stars burn out. The sun hasn't burnt out. However, that was due to movement, and that's what I believe in the theory of fusion. <sighs> so atoms started moving around, creating a fusion that once was done became white stars. That was, I believe, us before life as people. Stars in the universe. That's at least my theory. So if we were stars in the universe at one point, before we were human, I believe if we've done it before, we could do it again. And there could be a heaven and there could be, well, I like the words damn and hell because my name's Evan. All right. With that in mind, I question the theoretical age of the sun, the earth, and if we prove the guest age of dinosaurs to be wrong, and why, with the knowledge of the Big Bang Theory occurring due to sex, we may be able to get to a newer truth. You know, can, can a bone really last millions of years in the ground and be preserved? That is the ultimate question. You put a banana in the ground, you put food in the ground, you put a lot of different things in the ground and they decompose and they're not preserved. So looking at the more simple math, maybe we can estimate that some of these stars and suns and planets were, were not around as long as we think they were. Noting that this math was done decades ago and it has never been updated for recent times. So let's look into that someday. All right. Um, and back to what I would like to occur on The Bachelor. Well, I say let two girls kiss, you know, let them kiss. That would be interesting. It would make for a good show. Um, 
And yeah. All right. Well, I'll talk to you later and see you subscribe if you like. Um, all right.